everyone, welcome back to the Neo Nails channel. In this video, we're gonna do a big 3D flower covering the whole nail. So I've already done a base coat of this nail with First Night. It's gorgeous pink and I've done a matte top coat. Whenever you're going to do 3D, 3D flowers, I always recommend doing a matte top coat and it just sits nicely on top. So we're going to take mega white acrylic powder, some max adhesion and metallic red acrylic, our 3D brush and we are going to take quite a big bead of the white, small dip into the metallic red, pop the bead down let it settle second, then just gently start pressing the petal out. Keep your brush slightly slanted, you don't want it too flat. Because then you won't have any texture to your petals. Then we'll do the same again. But start at the bottom this time, let that petal dry at the top. You can keep going back if you're not happy with the texture in your petal because it doesn't set for a little while. As it's setting up, you can start playing about with the sides a little bit and give them a bit more of a 3D effect. And we'll work our way around the outside. Back down to the bottom. And we just want to layer it up really all the way around until we come into the middle. Push the petal, the sides of the petals in if you want. Give it a little bit of a wiggle. Do you like doing 3D? I do like doing 3D flowers, they're just really time consuming, there's no quick way of rushing no them that to or anything, yeah. no. <clears throat> and sometimes you don't realise when you're doing a lot of it how much time it's taken up of your appointment, but they are really nice. Do you get a lot of people asking for them? Yeah, quite a few. And I get carried away and then I look at the clock and I think, ooh, ooh, <laughs> the next one's due. So we all need things we can do in an appointment time. You want your petals to be quite irregular, so don't be too worried about them being all symmetrical because you don't want that really. Yeah, no flower is super uniform, is it? No, it is not. And now we've done the outside, we'll start layering up inside.
you want the petal to be underneath to be dry so don't try and do too many at once otherwise they'll just merge together and you'll be fuming you have to start again and no one's got time for that hell no When we get to the centre, we take a good bead, give it a couple of seconds to set up. Pop it down, leave it for a little bit for a minute. Then you want to put your brush in directly in the top, give it a gentle little wiggle to make a hole. Then cut it off, separate it, and just curl that middle bit in, like so. While the acrylic's still wet, no, oh, here we go. You stick a diamond <laughs> into it. Do you so not need any glue? These. Not while the acrylic's wet. While the acrylic's wet, it'll just keep hold of the diamond. So these pointy back crystals are ideal for this. Then you just let that dry and you are done. Beautiful. Set like rock. Hope you all enjoyed that video. We'd love to see any of your 3D designs. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram and Facebook and we'll see you in the next video.